Hello everyone, and thank you for joining us. We are excited to bring you this overview on ETAP 22. So let's go ahead and get started. ETAP 22 also has significant improvements to AC Arc Flash. AC Arc Flash allows us to reduce risk, improve safety, and enforce compliance. And you can do so now based on international standards. You can evaluate Arc Flash and Arc Fault based on IEC 60909. That includes the arc flash DK as well as single phase arc flash calculations. And you can also run arc flash simulations based on DGUV or the German arc flash standard. These options are essentially available in the arc flash study case for you to choose between different methods. We've also expanded our shock risk assessment list based on regional electrical worker safety standards. Standards that are traditionally included within ETA were NFPA as well as IEC standards, but we've also expanded them to include Canada, Mexico, Brazil, Russia, China, and so many more. And we will continue to expand the shock risk assessment safety standards in subsequent releases. ETAP 22 has thousands of new enhancements, features, and capabilities. Thank you.